Ladies and gentlemen, this next match is an eight-person internship match! Please welcome first, they are the team of your UCW Women's Champion, Demetria! Ladies and gentlemen, we are here at the Rocky Mountain Rumble. This is our second match of the evening, and we have got an incredible eight-person tag team match for one fall here tonight. This is Levi Lee, and I am accompanied ringside here by the one and only Jason, born and bred Bravo. He's got the body, he's got the mind, and he's got the voice here tonight. And we've got to see what kind of action we can expect from our first two competitors. Paradise in the far side corner, and Adam Reyes of No More Heroes near us. That's right, Levi. The crowd is hot and ready, and they are right behind Paradise, who is, like you said, she's about to start this match with No More Heroes member Adam Reyes, and Adam Reyes is just taking a knee, probably. Oh, oh okay. He just, he just shoved the woman right there. Things got a little disrespectful right off the back, and it's, hey, Paradise is one of our finest competitors. But it looks like Marty Daniels is going to settle the score for that uh, blatant show of disrespect here at the start of our eight-man tag. Well, not just a payback for that. Hold on. Was she just trying to do push-ups? Those were modified push-ups right there. I was about to say, that's not how you do push-ups. But, yeah, I was just going to say that Marty Daniels looking for revenge because it was Adam Reyes who cost Marty Daniels the women's championship. You've got to wonder, Marty Daniels is now facing one of our latest stars, Helen Ward, 
Whereas I'm pretty sure Marty Daniels wants to take a crack at our female women's champion here, Demetria, also in the opposite corner. Yep, Helen Ward yep. straight out of 1984, making her wrestling debut here tonight. And, and it looks like that, and it looks like Paradise and Helen Ward is gonna start things off. I am having quite a flashback to a decade I uh, very, very, barely remember with those uh, uh, high neon pants and that Walkman. I believe that's a tape cassette Walkman that Helen Ward brought out to the ring. Yeah, I wonder what she's got on her mixtape. Maybe a little bit of uh, New Wave, a uh, little bit of hair bands. Some Cindy Lauper. Yeah, de assume. yeah, definitely Cindy, right. Cindy Lauper. I mean, she is a big wrestling fan after all. Cindy that is Lauper. absolutely true. One of the true classic celebrities in the wrestling world. But, oh, we got a tie up here. Paradise oh, school girl with the payday now! Helen Ward may be new, but she's not that fresh off the boat. Oh, Paradise with a shootout, then Helen Ward with the reversal, but... Oh! Oh! What? Wait, but wait a minute, Helen Ward catches the kick of Paradise and... Now Paradise with the shootout off the ropes, and another counter. Oh, just a... Just a big thing of reversals here. Oh, interesting. Interesting takedown from the I'm top rope. I'm going to score a point for Helen Ward on that exchange right there. Yeah, definitely very express, it, it, impressive exchange, but but maybe I spoke too soon. Paradise dodging, making dodging. Oh, oh, nice headlock takedown to Helen Ward. I think Paradise is going to get even for that earlier lucky shot that Helen Ward got. The ladies are back up to their feet off the ropes. Helen Ward's probably going to wish that she stayed back in 1984 after this match. But Paradise oh, using Par all of her assets to her advantage and putting Helen Ward back in the opposite corner. And that's the thing about Paradise. She is fun-sized and just always looking to have a good time. She not, she not only has a competitive nature, but just has a kind heart and just loves making a positive impact, not on, on all the fans here in ECW. And oh, she nearly got the pin right there, Levi. Absolutely, she is not only fun, but she can be lethal when the time comes. And speaking of fun, tags in the returning Tommy Purr. We've got to see what, oh, we got a team maneuver here from Tommy Purr in Paradise. Oh, an incredible assisted splash from Tommy Purr using Paradise to crush Helen Ward. Oh, and Tommy, oh. and Tommy Pearl, oh. the fan favorite, the longtime fan favorite. Are we looking at a, a modified sharpshooter here against the newcomer, Helen Ward? I don't think she's seen something like this she before. Oh, but, and it, here comes, and the women's champion, Demetria, just cuts off Tommy Pearl. And that's, that's Demetria. She is a goddess. She saw someone in need and took the opportunity to help out her liege. Helen Ward, but now Demetrius got to face the longtime returning Tommy Pearl. And wait a minute, I think Hel <laughs> she's working. <laughs> oh, Paradise is trying. No, oh, no. sorry, I misspoke. But uh, Demetrius <laughs> trying to use her assets to uh, her Olympian like to, wild. Yeah, to seduce uh, Tommy Pearl, but uh, but uh, some people may not know, uh, Tommy Pearl does have uh, an alternative uh, choice of. Are you, are you saying that he's not buying what she's selling? Uh, definitely not. She is not interested in her assets for sure. Tommy Purr playing to the crowd. Oh, and Tommy Purr missed, missed Demetria in the corner, and Demetria with those, those high knees right to the midsection and just stomping away at Tommy Purr. If she can't use her feminine wiles, she's got no problem putting the boots to Tommy Pearl. She may be small, but Demetria definitely has a mean streak ever since, uh, and that's definitely probably one thing that helped her to win the women's t title. She reigns, she is reigning on top there, and let's see what she's got. Tommy yeah. Pearl might not be expecting this kind of action. He is in trouble, and Demetria's got, let's see if she can land this. Oh, and a spinning neckbreaker right there. And Demetria with the pin, but no. That no. spinning neck breaker is known as Olympus Rising as our Demetria is laying waste to Tommy Purr and bringing in Vlad, the Siberian soldier, Balashov to finish him off. I was just going to say, I mean, Tommy Purr may be a little bit more on the feminine side, but he's still really tough. It take, it'll take a lot more than that to put Tommy Purr down, but, but Vlad Balashov just may be what his team needs to get the victory and put Tommy Purr away. And no! Oh! Tommy Pearl with the chin breaker and kick, kick legs sweeping. What's Tommy Pearl got in mind here? He's going up to the top. 
This might be exactly what need to, Tommy Purr is going to need against a guy like Vlad. He's got to take the advantage, go for the high-risk maneuver, and hopefully put Vlad away on something like this. I think he was trying to make his way up the top, but then thought better to it's a little down to the middle row, but uh, he looks a little shaky. I, he looks a little concerned. He's he's coming down. <laughs> he's, he's coming down from there. Tommy oh. Purr, not the most uh, agile in the UCW Zero roster, but... Uh, I said high risk. We're going with moderate risk. Oh! oh. To low <laughs> risk to almost no risk. And Five. missing the target as well. And oh! Oh! Vlad Pelashop with a chop to the gut. And Vlad, Vlad with those fists and of steel. A, and a Russian leg sweep with the pin. Could this be it? And no! Those Siberian steel fists on Tommy Purr's skull. Tommy Purr is going to have to find the different corner because he's in that neutral corner, and he's all teed up. Oh, a oh, counter. Big, Beautiful elbow. Yeah, big elbow to the big chin of Vlad Balashoff, and could this be it? Wait a minute, yes! Purr Karana! Ladies and gentlemen, the Purr Karana Pur from Tommy Purr. He may be nervous on the top and rope, but he's got the moves. The hot tag to Adrian! And Adwan is on fire, and the crowd is just as hot. Adwan the Viking putting down the Siberian soldier, and nobody in the Siberian soldier's corner is looking to help him out at this crucial moment. And wow. Vlad Balashov is tough, but when it comes to one-on-one -on -one against Adwan, then deadlifting him from the ground and slamming him down. We've got to wonder if Odwan's going to be able to put this away, but he's got plenty of people in his corner that have got some payback for Vlad. Marty Daniels, our former women's champion, looking to lay the chops down. Oh! Big chop to the big Russian. And, oh, wait a minute. Odwan Adwan might be having a chop of his mind. Chop of his own. And, oh! They felt that one in Valhalla. <laughs> Definitely, I mean. Oh! Mm. And Marty Daniels with, with another chop, and Marty Daniels is striking. Oh! oh! Striking up the band like it's Mardi Gras in there with Vlad, Vlad Balashov's chest as the steel drum. I don't think they prepa quite prepared him for big chops with his fist mask. Beautiful big kick from Marty Daniels. Vlad doesn't know what's going on. Oh, wow. and Helen Ward from behind him. Oh, that's, that's not the way to make an impression around here, Helen Ward. Definitely not, and... And Marty Downs a big shoot up. Oh, wait. Could this be? Oh, like a sunset. Going for the sunset one right there. And oh. Again, Adam Reyes once again cheap shotting Marty Daniels. I'm not even sure who the legal competitors are right now. I think, I think it's still Helen Ward. I thought Marty Helen Daniels. Ward. I, I didn't see the tag. It might have been a blind tag. I think there could have been, but, but now Helen Ward makes the legal tag to Adam Reyes. Our referee but oh, wait a minute, Helen Ward choking yep. out See, I the knew. former women's champion with that with I the, knew with there that would Rockman. be confusion. I knew there would be confusion. Was that a was that a new wave choking over there? Well, what, what do you call it when you choke someone out with a 1980s Walkman? Some sort of blast from the past from Helen Ward? You gotta wonder. Adam Reyes in complete control here against Marty Daniels. Well, this is something you don't, you definitely don't see from the Breakfast Club. That's for sure. Absolutely not. 80s weapons right there for those of you who don't know. Oh, and a big elbow to Marty Daniels. And Adam Reyes with the pin. Could this be it? And no. Oh, Ooh, after that incredible off the turnbuckle tornado DDT from Adam Reyes, you got to wonder how Marty Daniels was able to kick out after that. Oh, Adam's going to wear it down with that incredibly brutal headlock. Adam Reyes has got plenty of body to use against her in this, uh, this situation. But the fans and Marty Daniels' team are cheering Marty on. And she uses that, that energy. Oh! Oh, oh that, that's oh, not right, even... right to the eyes and... Oh! Whoa! But to, I, I have no idea how, but... Had very little effect at Marty Daniels coming up with the big line. Adam Reyes might be spitting out chiclets after that blow to the blow to his teeth right there. Marty Daniels landed that clothesline right across his jaw, and he must be furious. Oh! It is getting I personal, and it is getting loud in there. 
Adam Reyes has got Marty Daniels off the ropes. But Marty Daniels with the reversal in. Oh, wait a minute. Oh! I think he's going for a back body drop, but Adam Reyes with a big kick it. We oh, missed time oh! that one. Power slam in! No! Only a two count right there, Levi. Kelly's got to stay on his toes if he's going to officiate a match like this. Marty Daniels almost had that full three count. She's begging for it. She felt like she had it. I just, I just don't understand. Oh, oh I was just going to say, I don't understand why uh, Marty Daniels uh -oh. wasn't going for the tag. Uh -oh. Demetria went for a cheap shot, and she didn't quite land it because Marty Daniels is ready to lay her to waste ringside here. Uh-oh. And she's got a hold of the champion. Ooh. That is the women's champion right there. You can't just toss her around. She's not the legal competitor. And now she's got the champ up on her shoulders and... Oh, big Samoa drop. And Marty Daniels still giving them the verbal beatdown as Adam Reyes, our legal man, and Demetria, our innocent victim and women's champion, are both in there. Can Marty Daniels give them payback at the exact same time? Ooh. Oh! I think, she, I think Marty Daniels was going for a, going for a clothesline on Adam Reyes, but Adam shoving the champ right in front of him. Yeah, Adam giving the blind tag to Vlad Balashov, and Vlad in trouble because I want his back in the ring. Wait, Marty Daniels is leaving the ring as well. She's Wait following minute. Adam Reyes out of the ring. We've got chaos ringside now, and chaos within. Helen Ward is oh. up top. Ooh. Face first, right on the top turnbuckle. Shoots her off to Tommy Purin. Now Tommy Purin's got Helen Ward up on his shoulders. What has he got in mind here? Oh! Spinning TKO! You've and, got now, to wonder. and now Alderman's got Vlad up on his shoulders. Oh! Gut buster and I think this is it right here, Levi, and oh, it is! That's it. This match is over! Ladies and gentlemen, your winners! Vlad Vyasov pinned by a combination of Adwan, Paradise, Paradise was on not quite that long, guys, and Tommy Purr. There we go. That is a dominating force here in the UCW Zero, here at the Rocky Mountain Rumble. Demetria was not able to win this evening, though she will keep the women's championship belt as she leaves the arena. Well, I'm here, ladies and gentlemen.